there? Who? Do you remember me? No, I don't really remember you. Who are you and where are you actually? Uh, I should get back into video making maybe. Who are you? I'm Tim from one of your house building videos. Do you remember? Tim, is that you? Oh my god! Not anymore, I'm the magic toilet. Oh, <laughs> oh you are the magic toilet! Oh my god, okay. Yes, and what are you gonna do about it? What I'm gonna do about it, I'm gonna make Becky go and use you. She need to poop, of course. No! Becky had a big self-confidence today. It was her first day at work. It w oh, uh, she was really excited. And who know what is gonna happen in this episode? And who are you? Uh, Monica is also excited, but I think she is very tired, and she wants to go home to her kids and play with them. Sit in the chair and say hello. What are you going to say? It's very quiet right now. But Becky started to uh, talk about mobile uh, cell phones, but he was more into llamas. <laughs> but now the, lo the llama can be in mobile. But we can take a coffee, is what Becky says. But enough with chit chat. This time to make some action. And we went to the crime scene, of course. The boy bedroom. She was uh, looking very all over uh, all over the place and she saw the bed it looks very pretty oh my god what did she find a cigarettes that is a good thing to have she thought to herself but now she wanted to you know tell and discuss some police stuff with her colleagues oh my god and there, the storyteller just see a mirror in front of her, his face, and he, he can't see Becky at all. But when he moved the camera around, she was gone. <laughs> oh, maybe here, search for clues. She went all around the place, all around the backyard, because I didn't want her to do that. So she went back inside the house. <laughs> and. I said you was going to pick that up a long time ago, but Becky didn't do that. She wanted to do something on her own, and who knows. And uh, she wanted to make some hot dogs just in a random... Uh, <laughs> so Becky just did some random hot dogs, barbecuing of course, in the, the backyard of the, the crime scene's backyard. Because she wanted to do that, because she was hungry and she didn't care, of course. And what we have here, <gasps> there are things here that you need to discover, pick up this tra trash can, who knows what is gonna be inside that, a mouse or, or even a lion, who knows? <laughs> She couldn't do that, so we have, she put the trash back on the ground and pick up the trash can, so she could take the trash and place it to the trash can again. And she asked, why did I do that? We didn't do any much, but we find a glow in the kitchen. Take a photo. Of course, we need to take more stuff, and oh my god. Take a photo of the fridge because it have been burnt down. It's been a very productive day here in the, this crime scene, and oh my god, someone has been out here in the trash can again. And who is this? The suspect must be near. We need to find. No, we just earned 27 simoleons, which is a very, very bad amount of money. Or simoleons, if you have to say that. It was a very productive day. But she couldn't find the suspect or the thing. But she went back to the police station, of course. No, she didn't went back to the police station. She went home. It's been a very good day. 
The Magic Toilet, I'm back. Ooh, please, you Grim. see you. <laughs> And who is this the suspect? Can we go and uh, oh my god, that is an enemy. Who is she? We need to go out here. Who are you? She is very angry, of course. We're gonna pause the game because the storyteller wanted to see that. This is Annette. She's very old, but she can be the suspect who put down the trash. I mean, the trash can. She can also. Oh my god, the glows. They fit on her hands. Oh my god. But she wanted to, of course, continue. Uh, she was playing some games on her computer. Just an ordinary day. It's, it's Indiana Sim on the television. Indiana Sim. And she was most excited about this TV show. She was eating her, uh, of course, her... Good heart cakes. Do you like it, Becky? Yeah, you do. Yes, you do. It's turning up. It's getting more and more intense in the television right now. And now it ended. And uh, this day is over. And she wanted to get into bed. And of course, that is a very nice thing to do. Did Becky said because it's have been a productive day today But we're gonna of course continue with the uh, Llama and Apple fish story of course It's gonna be amazing she thought the storyteller thinks that as well. Don't you think magic toilet? <laughs> yeah, you, you don't speak now don't you? Oh, so Becky just went back downstairs just to... Oh my god, it is... Die seem hard in television. Oh my god. It's another day. It's another day at the police station and Becky just realized that the suspect have red hair. So, here, somewhere, the suspect have red hair and we're gonna find out who it is okay so an enemy right over there is coming just af af towards us and what gonna happen is she is he gonna take her his gun out after an hour he stopped and starting to walk again everyone seems to be really angry at Becky <laughs> you can see the suspect I, I need to take this I need to take a photo of this suspect but the storyteller just noticed a man in the shadows over there it was his she's boyfriend oh she wanted to be sexy and not doing the police stuff right now oh there we have it I see it the person have red hair and I see her right in the moment just ignore everything else Becky we you see the suspect over here with an, a red afro. She she's very she's very angry. I can see like everyone else, not do a friendly interaction with you because she is very angry and she can be a very dangerous woman. Who knows? She she maybe have a gun in her pants or something like that. She wanted to go to her magic toilet at home, but she couldn't do that. She was very very wanted to pee but that is for another story because now is the end of this episode and we have find a suspect today but uh, she couldn't find anything and uh, our um, of course boyfriend we're gonna talk more in the later episode my job is of course to make your sims happy and bye